Hello and welcome back to our video series on prompt engineering for AI chatbots. As a quick refresher, prompt engineering is the art of crafting inputs to AI chatbots in order to achieve higher quality outputs. In today's video, we're going to be discussing and reviewing the importance of doubling down and repeating yourself within your prompt. Repetition can be a powerful tool within any form of communication and chatting with AI bots is no exception. By repeating key terms or phrases, you guide the AI's model's attention to specific aspects of the query. This helps with honing in on the precise information or details you are seeking. Doubling down also minimizes the chance of ambiguity or misinterpretation. AI models often thrive on clear, specific instructions. Repetition clarifies your intent, reducing the likelihood of generic or broad responses. Okay, let's see this in action with Microsoft's Copilot. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and submit our first prompt and it reads, write me a catchy slogan for a fast car. Now, before we hit submit, we're gonna change our conversational style to be more creative. Since we're not looking for anything specific here and we're looking for kind of a more of an imaginative response, um, the more creative conversational style will be perfect. So we'll go ahead and hit submit. And we'll see what we get. Okay, so we're getting some good responses here. Um, definitely referencing the speed of the vehicle as we specified in our prompt. Um, so these are pretty good actually, um, but I think we can do a little bit better. I've written a revised prompt here I'm going to hit new topic. This one reads, again, write me a catchy slogan for a fast car. But as per the theme of this episode, we're going to be doubling down um, and we're going to specify, be sure to emphasize the speed and sportiness of the vehicle. Highlight the features and technical specifications that contribute to its speed. And we'll hit submit. Okay, so we can already see we're getting a little more detailed in our responses here, uh, referencing as we as we requested some of the technical specs of the vehicle and really emphasizing the speed and sportiness of the car. Okay, shifting gears here, we're going to throw in another prompt. Uh, this one reads, draft an email to inform team members about an urgent meeting on Tuesday. And again, we're gonna go with our creative conversational style here and hit submit. Okay, so we have our email coming in here. Uh, first glance, it appears to be written very well, very professionally, which of course is what we want if we're informing our team members of an urgent meeting. Um, having said that, the model seems to be taking some creative liberties uh, with the email content here. Uh, it's mentioning a new project that's been assigned to us by a client, discussing project scope, timeline budget. None of this was mentioned really within our prompt so, um, you know, it's you know, granted, this was a very generic prompt that we submitted to the model. Um, so it is kind of filling in some gaps for us. But having said that, um, you know, this this content may or may not be applicable uh, for our specific use case. So we'll see if we can get a little more specific here. And I've drafted a, another prompt. Um, again, the topic of today's episode being double down, we're going to be reiterating what we're looking for here. Um, and this prompt reads, draft an email to inform team members about an urgent meeting on Tuesday. Highlight the importance of attending the meeting, 
and the necessity of confidentiality regarding the meeting topic. We'll go ahead and hit submit. One thing I'd like to point out, uh, I find this kind of amusing, today is November 30th, um, and it is picking up that the next, the upcoming Tuesday will be December 5th, 2023. Uh, so I thought that was kind of neat. But our email seems to be more on topic here. I'm again mentioning the need for confidentiality and urgency um, to meet on this topic. Okay, and one more demo here. Uh, here are prompt states. What are the three trends in IT for 2023? Okay, and it's pulling in a response from this blog here. Uh, artificial intelligence, of course. Uh, Internet of Things, good. Uh, and industry cloud platforms, okay. And uh, providing a bit of a list here from another source. Okay, uh, so all around, uh, not a bad response from the model. Maybe a little light, uh, providing a little more context around each of these three and, and as to why they're important, and why they're so impactful uh, within 2023, but uh, overall not bad. Uh, but let's see if we can do a little better, of course. Again, we're going to be doubling down here. Um, so our revised prompt states, uh, what are the top three trends in IT for 2023? Highlight the most impactful and important developments within the industry. Outline why these trends are so important. So really, we're reiterating ourselves here about three times, um, really driving that point home. And again, it's going to reference that same blog. Uh, but here, providing a little more detail as to why these trends are important. And just a little additional context within each. Okay, so to summarize, doubling down and repeating key elements in your prompts isn't just about language. It's an important tool in optimizing AI interactions. By emphasizing specific terms, you guide the AI's focus, ensuring precise responses and minimizing the risk of ambiguity. Clarity is crucial in AI communication and repetition acts as a powerful ally in achieving it. Whether you're aiming for productivity or precision, don't underestimate the impact of this simple yet effective prompt engineering technique. So that's a wrap for today's exploration of prompt engineering. If you'd like to chat more about AI, feel free to reach out to us at clearconcepts.ca slash AI to set up an AI discovery chat for your organization. Also, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, happy prompting.